Episode 3, don't forget to like this video. Is the president of the church of Alabama Bug. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. Praise be to thee, our Father in heaven. And our second guest. So this apartment building doesn't look too different from what we see today. Maybe I can open up this door, can I? I guess not. Nothing is letting me hack. So whatever. Is this my place? Okay, this is actually a pretty spacious apartment. I thought maybe it would be a small apartment. Hey! I don't really have much in my weapon stash just yet. But I'm sure that's going to change in no time. And this game has some crazy weapons. Just looking at the list of all the possibilities. Oh, look at this. Are we just powering down to go to sleep? I actually kind of like that. Wouldn't you like that? To be able to just automatically go to sleep. Lay down. You don't even have to wait. Just turn yourself off and wake up the next morning. <laughs> I could get down with that. Oh, V! You get any sleep? No matter. Time you got up. I think I might have caught something when I jagged into that corpo's bile mine. I don't know. Uh, Neurof Iris, sir. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Throw some threads, meet me downstairs. Slide, slide. Hear me? I don't know who this guy is. I don't know if it's a husband or what, so I won't kill him. I'll just knock him out. And let's see what she does. What an awful place! Oh no, okay, so maybe I should have killed him then, because she just thanked me for that. I officially live in the hood. Hey, yo, V. No, no How about a round or two? I, I can't. What do you say? How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next-gen ass whooping he did. So this condo building, apartment, whatever you want to call this, they have a whole bunch of stores right here on this floor. We're so far in the future, but yet this elevator looks like... It's this from back in the day. They got some HD TV screens right there, but. Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. T-Bug sent me. Said you'd have something for me. You're V, right? She had me hold the demon for you. It should work on any third gen deck. Got a Militech power line. Think it'll do. Mm. Solid gear. For a beginner. Okay. Glad to grab a demon always. You could test it now. I have an access point, if you'd like, that is. You might extract some shim soft or subroutines. Seems worth a try, either way. How's this work? Any punk off the street can waltz in here, grab some shady running soft? No, not just any punk. Over the counter, we fix cyber decks. But if you come recommended and you know what you are looking for, I'm sure you will find it. This new device, this quick hack, the ping, gonna let me know where everybody is when I pull up, so that's nice. So I'm switching it up, I'm gonna add the new ping, and then I'm gonna get rid of this reboot because that doesn't seem that nice. I'm gonna go with the weapons glitch. That's something I need. I need to be getting glitchy out here. I need to stop them from using their weapons. So, looks like we found the last honest cop in this city. Her what name's is? Anna Hamill, and whatever she's investigating, it's made her a lot of enemies. She'd do best to cut it out if you catch my drift. 
Okay, look, what I know how it sounds, but what do you somebody think? would have taken this gig this anyway, right? I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. This game is different from most games. All of these side missions, they actually change the main story. You start adding characters and adding different things. So I'm going to be playing a lot more side missions and showing them. Mm. Man of the hour. <laughs> Jeez, took you long enough. Worked up an appetite, just waiting. Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Didn't figure you as a type for Asian. Would have thought you'd find it too exotic. What do you mean? What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Synth sirloin? Check. Get some more chile action up in here and you're looking at Mama Well's signature sopa de fideo. <laughs> Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated coup. How'd you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You know me? No. Oh, but T-Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on, ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. Thought Dex bounced out of the ring a few years ago. Messed with the nasty crew in Pacifica. Things got ugly. Mm-hmm. Gang wars two years back. Somehow Dex got caught up in the craziness. There's a lot of bodies lying in the streets by the time the shooting stopped. I'm fine. Yeah, Dex got lucky though. Managed to slip under the radar till tempers cooled. Took a while, but he's made one hell of a comeback. Eyes up to his elbows in blood, Jack. You want to shake his hand? Work with him? It's the biz, V. Everyone's got blood on their hands. You deal with it. You move on. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal is right in the Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you. Talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong, don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is a league of his own. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit, hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. I gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dusting with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Stop. Ripper Duck. And Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. That's it for today's latest. 
I was supposed to stop by Vic's anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know? The hell? No. This first person driving view is actually pretty nice. Maybe I'll keep it, maybe I won't. I don't know, I think you can switch it. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. I think the most amazing part about the city so far is that most of the buildings, it looks like you can interact with them, go in them. Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. Vicky, Sprite. As ever, you old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. I think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, Kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But? Something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Any tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Wow, I owe him 21,000. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? I don't even know how much money I have right now. I think maybe a few hundred or maybe a thousand. I'm not sure. Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. This game is insane. Not only do you have skills and perks, but look at all of this that you're going to be able to upgrade all these different categories. Wow. It's actually maybe overwhelming right now because I'm not exactly sure what way I want to go, what direction, how I want to build my player. I'm upgrading my vision first. My other upgrade is for the hands. Let's see what they got there. And this is going to be increase the chance to ricochet shots with power weapons see power weapons are going to be some cheese so we got to get all these upgrades then mark one like i said decent enough scanner displays data on your cornea cherry on the tops a built-in external lens disruptor in layman's terms any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur and just remember your body will still show up as crystal clear Hmm, this should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. 
display that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Same as always. Don't feel a thing. You ask me that every time, you know? Not as if things are gonna be any different today. Sure thing, kid. I mean, not like there's any risk of a stroke or paralysis, but <laughs> what do I know? I'm just a doctor. That's what I thought. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Seen more dramatic improvements before. Patience, kid. Give it a minute. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm. <laughs> With anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. It's very interesting how they introduce us to all of these possibilities for upgrades. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra skull lining. Absorb 75% of every blow. Got cash riding on this. Nah, just looking. <laughs> it's out of habit more than anything else. Miss it, don't you? Ah. Uh... How's Biz going? Uh, can't complain. Corporals learn to keep their distance, and Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. Good thing you got Misty here to help. Handles your griping well. Yeah, renting out her shop's the best decision I ever made. You know what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with this lot. You get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life just gets easier from there. I'm gonna end this episode right here. Don't forget to like this video. The next episode is already on the way.
You better step it up or you're going to be on a bus heading back to Jersey Shore. Newark. Wherever. Sit. Unbelievable. Wait, what? Why would the coach be mad at me? I had a dominating performance. I had a great game. What is he talking about? Look at these stats.